I'm Deceased Crab. Let's play I Was in the War. I Was in the War is an exciting game about jumping over little guys. It's a military conflict. See the missiles in the background? Military. You can flip on the one axis. I guess it's the x-axis. And you can jump. And you can jump and flip in midair. See how deftly I avoid them? Listen to how silly the music is. This is a game whose sole purpose is to just go right. Head right, you grow larger over time. If you keep going right, new things happen, like missile strikes commencing. Oh, look at him go. Getting taller by the second. Who walks like that? Who waves their arms up and down like that? I ask you. The music is by no means an orchestral masterpiece, as you'd hear in another game. But it's got a silly wonky sort of thing. It's cheerful. Aw, I was doing so well, too. Whoa. Tanks? What do you mean tanks? Whoa. Stop that. Stupid tanks. I don't need to put up with them. Running into tanks is a good way to get yourself killed right away. Oh. Yeah. Best flip when you see a tank. Oh, sure, you might take some damage from little running guys, but hey, better damage than certain death. Speak of the devil, more tanks! And the game is normally a little faster than this. I don't think there are enough missiles raining down on me. We need a few more. Also, being tall enough to run your head into a helicopter? Bad. Like that. Ow. Better a helicopter shaving off your head than a tank. The graphics are nothing to really write home about, but I like them. They're very old school and earnest. Pretty detailed for that. Also, the 30 degree angle horrifies me. I haven't seen anything this crazy since, well, the Soldiers, which is a great game that you should also play. Ah, the chipperness of this music makes me smile. So, after Guerrilla Tactics, there's only one thing left. Just one. Will I live that long? No telling. We're almost at the end. Starting a new game immediately after beating it has its own special reward. Nuke? I don't like the sound of that. Whoa! Hey, I can't breathe radiation. Ah, oh, nuts! Well, that's how the game ends. Let's try it again. Something is different this time. I can't quite put my finger on it. I... hmm. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. There's definitely something on that guy's chest. What is it? Well, it's getting bigger. Maybe more detail will help? I don't know, the video's already compressed down a little bit. It's probably pretty hard to read. Wait, I'm starting to get it. Yeah, pause it, maybe that'll help. It doesn't help when it's flipped. Ah, now I can read it. It says, I was in the war and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. Great. That is the benefit of beating the game. Next time through, you get the sarcastic t-shirt. This isn't a political statement, it's just goofy. Try not to find meaning in something so silly as this. Ah.
Well, at least the music is nice and upbeat. I don't think I've quite run this joke into the ground yet. And here come the tanks again. I wonder if I can make it all the way back to Nuke Nuke Nuke. Oh yeah, that's definitely legible. You kitties stop fighting! I was in the war! Huzzah! Yeah, it stopped them. Or at the very least, made them take crap on my bed. One of the two. Stupid tanks. Stupid missiles. Ah. Yeah, there's just no dealing with helicopters if you have to jump a lot. Your points are mostly based on your height. As far as I can tell, your points increase proportional to how much health you have. If you get hit a lot, your score will be less. Much less. There we go, guerrilla tactics. Little jumping purple guys. Wow, I'm really getting my butt handed to me this run. The only thing saving me from dying is the slowdown. The game normally runs at about 1.5 the speed. Is this an improvement? Maybe. We're not gonna get nuked at this rate. No, seriously, who walks like that? If I raised and lowered my arms alternately, all the time, people would have me locked up. I mean, it's hilarious, but it's kind of weird, even for me. I'm Deceased Crab. This has been Let's Play I Was in the War. Good night.